Oh! Get behind this box! Hey, good. Okay. Yeah. I got that kill. Wait, this guy. We actually up here. Oh, is this cheating? Yo, man, we're back out here on some World War II real quick now. Yo, there's been a lot of videos that I've been wanting to make recently. There's been videos that I've made, in fact, and I've just not put up because they didn't really go too well. Alright, first off, I unlocked this camo for a video, which looks cool out here, but then when you go into the firing range with it, it looks pretty dead. So let's grab that one. And other than that, really, I haven't been uploading just because I've had a load of college work to do. If you don't know, I'm in college doing A-level, so I've had a lot of work to do recently, man. Like, a lot. So I've kind of been focusing on that, so I haven't really been able to upload too much. I'm going to be trying to upload a lot more, even though I've got a load of exams coming up, but I don't know if you just noticed some changes in my videos, and you know why, man. Literally just had no time recently, but yo, we're out here on World War II. And hold on, look at my weapon real quick. You ready for this? Bang! You see that king? Down! It's looking clean. I know it is. I know you like that. I just made a paint shop like really quick. It's not that good, I know. But I don't know if you guys remember, but when World War II first came out, there was a thing you could do where you could put the steady aim attachment on your weapon, right? And then literally, you just wouldn't have to aim in. Like, look at this. I've got the steady aim on now. You literally just wouldn't have to aim in. You could destroy absolutely anyone from like basically any range. Now, apparently, this has come back. Apparently, they've buffed the steady aim attachment, so it does the similar thing. I'm not too sure. I'm just hearing this. So, we try that out again in firing range. It seems pretty pretty good like i could destroy these so well, yeah we're gonna try it out and see how this thing rocks but obviously before we do get into this make sure you smash that like button on this video real quick i know you guys i've been wondering where the videos are at so i'm, I'm trying to get back into it honestly guys. so make sure you smash that like button also if you're new around here make sure you subscribe to the channel i'm still trying to get to 100k like i really am trying to grind towards it but then i've got college work to do it's just it's just mad annoying, man. It really is. It honestly is. I just joined a free for all on hq why did i not know this was a thing the hell is this wait what? You can really? Bro, this is my spawns have got to be. Oh, wait. Oh, no. My control settings are wrong as well, but I don't really have time to change them. Why are you. What? Wait. Oh, yeah. The hit fire really does work. Get that guy. You no, know hold up. Let me change my settings. I think it's in here. Wait. Holy mess up. This is for Fortnite. There we go. All right. We're good now. now let's get this W. I Yo, this is crazy. I like this implementation, though. I like this. My first game on in a while, but it's cool. I like it. Oh, yeah, we really should have hit fired that guy. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, yo. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, I really don't know the spawns. That's mine. The guy's going to come from here, I reckon. He's going to spawn it right here. <laughs> yeah, the spawns are kind of crazy. Yo, I like this. I actually do like this. I just don't know where the spawns are. That's my problem. And I wonder if you can get on top of the headquarters, if you know what I'm saying. Like, like oh, he had a shotgun as well. Alright, we're in the lead though, so I guess I'll take that. I feel like this is going to be an easy W, but I really want to see if you can get on top of the headquarters like that. That would be pretty cool. I don't, I don't know. Let's see. Let me get up here. It seems, it seems a little bit easier as well. I'm not trying to get in anyone's way. Oh, wait, chill. Wait. Don't bother me. We get that kill. Yo. Wait, I'm really up here. I'm really on top of the back. Oh, is that guy looking? Oh, we're up. We actually up here. Oh, is this cheating? Yo, boys. Sick. Love that. But you actually can do it. Yo, that's crazy. At least I know that now. So let's get the W. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Wait. Oh, yo. Let's get this hit fire. Oh, man. Yo, it's easy. I'm telling you, this attachment still works. It really does. I don't know if it stopped working. Can we get... Can we get that? Oh, my God. I don't know if it stopped working and started working again, but it works. I'm telling you. I, yo, finally, I found a lobby. I swear, I've been sitting here for a good, like, half an hour. I don't know why, but I just struggled to find lobbies on this game. Okay. Can I get that kill? Wait, this guy... Yo, no way. No way he just let me do that to him. I, I don't even know what to say. I actually don't even know what to say about that. Anyway, we're going to try this hip fire thing. I don't know if they're going to push through here or not. Come on, man. 
What? Wait, I just got hit through like two walls, like that one and this one. Hey, I've been noticing, man. I wonder if skill-based matchmaking is in this game. I feel like it is because, yo, the lobbies I be getting into, man, full-on sweat lobbies, like no lie, everyone. Everyone's a try-hard, I feel like. I don't remember the last time I got into like a full-on newbie lobby, but with like other Call of Duties, that would happen quite a lot. So I don't really know. I don't know. I don't really know how the matchmaking works in this game and how it's different to like other, co ooh, ooh, okay. And how it's different to like other Call of Duties, but it feels like there's something. It feels like there's something there. Hold up. I just want to use this hit fire stuff. I want to see. There's one. Oh my. All right, let's get these UAV in. So I don't really know where they're at. But yo, tell me my camo isn't legendary. Like, come on, look at that. We're all sitting in the back of the spawn right now, which is kind of, kind of annoying. Thank you. Got your teammate. I think my teammate died still. Oh, what? Well, now I have got something to tell you guys, which I will tell you after the, after this uh, after this game. Hold up. I'm pushing. Okay. So many people like up here right now. Give me that. Okay. All right. Cool. Get down here. Get his UAV in as well. So I don't. How? Teammate, kill him, please. Thank you. Oh, get behind this box. Head glitch. There we go. No, man. Why are you coming behind me? But yeah, man. The steady aim thing does seem kind of nice. Like if you get used to um, if you get used to like. Wait, hold up. If you get used to knowing when you should aim in, when you can hit fire, like when it's best for you, then you can really do some damage with this. I'm dead serious. Hold up, let's get this one. Okay, you don't really need to hit fire that one. But stuff like that, you know what I'm saying? Where it's like, it's better for you to hit fire than like wasting time aiming in. That's the thing, like you're really saving time. Like sack aiming in, man. You can get your bullets off quicker. That's what this really does. Aye. That's right, give me that. Hold up. That's a nice two kills right there. Do we get a third? Oh, is that? Yo, tell me how I destroyed him like that. Look at the king on the side of my gun. It looks clean. And hey, all I'm saying is, you guys may have noticed there's been one thing, one thing in this video that I haven't complained about so far. Bang. You see that? See what this is right here? That's a new controller, man. <laughs> Finally, I don't have those analog stick problems. You know how annoying that was? Like, honestly, that was the most annoying thing. Let me show you guys my class again. So we got the candy right here with the steady aim, advanced rifling, rapid fight. In fact, low key, I kind of won. You know what? Let's try this. Let me put on extended mags as well. I don't know. I'm going to try it out. I I'm just going to see how it works. I don't know if it's going to work out. We're just testing stuff out in this video. That's what we're doing. Right, so we switched up the division. Like, literally, the steady aim thing, what it does is, like, when you're in, like, a close range gunfight or medium range, it prevents you having to aim in just so, like, wait, hold up. It prevents you having to aim in so you can save time, get your bullets off quicker, and for the most part, win the gunfight. We get that kill. Thank you. Yeah, for the most part, you can win the gunfights. Literally, just, just for that small amount of time that you've saved, you can win more gunfights. Let me know if you guys use it, but I just threw on the infantry division just so I can try out this setup with extended mags, like get an extra attachment so I can spray a little bit more because usually you only have... Oh, that's a guy. Usually you only have 30 bullets, but now I have 45 in each clip, which is, makes it a little bit better. Hold up. No, man! So every time I decide to put in a UAV, I die. But yeah, man, we really got a new controller out here. I had to do it. I literally had to do it, man. It was getting so annoying playing with, like, a broken controller. I don't know why it took me so long to buy one, to be real with you. Like, I really should have done it a lot sooner. And it's worth it. It's definitely worth it. I don't know if any of you guys have had the problem that I had. I don't know why I had it, but the analog stick was completely messed up. I could barely turn. There we go. Yo, my biggest pet peeve is when people camp. I swear, man. Like, my biggest pet peeve is when people camp at the... Get destroyed, man. People camp at the back... With... Bro, stop it. That's why I got more hit markers than I should have. All right. Yeah, when people camp, man, it gets on my nerves so much. Like, oh, oh, wait. Literally, there's no way I could sit at the back of the map for the entire game. There's no way. I just couldn't do it. Oh, he got destroyed as well. I just couldn't do it. I would get extremely bored. I'd have to change positions and stuff like that. <laughs> like, legit, nah, it's not. Oh, nah, I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm so dead. Bro, can I? Bro. Bro. Hello? Nah, there's probably a sniper back there. I, should, I shouldn't have challenged. Yeah. Oh, no. Chill. Oh, there is a sniper back there. Wait. No. And again, I know I've said this before, but when I complain about campers, I just know there's a good few people watching the video that do the exact same thing. I wonder how you react to that. Is he like a, is he like a defense to it? Is he an argument that people have that camp? Wait, hold on. Oh, man. Is he a camper's argument that you have? And when people say to you, stop camping, what do you say? Like, honestly, what do you say? Five minutes later. For some reason, I just wanted to hop back on HQ. I really did. I don't know why, but I wanted to try it out again on this map. It just seemed mad fun. It's something new. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Extreme lag. Didn't like that. Did me that did I get that? Alright, cool. My man just had extreme and I just spawned on top of this guy. Can we get Man, can I stop spawning and die? Thank you. Give me another No way. No. 
<laughs> Try it out again on this mic. It just seemed mad fun. It just seemed mad fun. Five. Thank you. Give me another. No way. No. 